diagnosis. My name is Jason Newland. Please only listen to this when you can safely close your eyes. What I'm going to do in this recording is I'm just going to talk. I'm not going to ask you to do anything. There's no technique. There's no instructions to follow. This is just me talking. And I'm just going to be a case of listening. say those words that you deserve to sleep easily and soundly it brings up memories of hearing people say in the past uh, the sentence is quite famous overused sentence in movies and probably arguments. The sentence is, how do you sleep at night? And it's kind of like laying a guilt trip. The idea that whatever we've done in our lives should affect our sleep. And you know what? Every one of us has made mistakes in the past. Every one of us. To various degrees. And I think it's time that we all just forgive ourselves and give ourselves permission to sleep soundly and easily it's time to just let go of the past Even if it's just when you're lying down in your bed,
sleep because you don't have to think about that stuff because it's not relevant nor helpful in any way just in the same way when you're eating your breakfast in the morning you're not thinking about what you're going to eat for dinner in four months time who cares it doesn't matter it's unimportant it's just stuff you're not going to be thinking about what you had for lunch 16 years ago why would you it's just trivial stuff unimportant and even the important stuff is unimportant when you're lying down on your bed your head touches a pillow your body relaxes and your mind slows down nothing is important everything that needs to happen happens automatically of your control not needing your control your breathing your heart your lungs your kidneys your liver your brain all of that stuff the blood flow it all happens naturally it does not need you to do if we did have to concentrate on that we would never be able to sleep the fact is we don't need to concentrate on that just as we don't need to concentrate on sleeping because it's not necessary it's the opposite to useful of course you can want to fall asleep relaxed and calm you can expect to fall asleep relaxed and easily you don't need to do anything because it will just happen naturally and that space safe space when you lie down on your bed your head touches the pillow your body just naturally relaxes you don't have to do anything for your body to relax because your body is used to lying down on your bed it's used to that it knows that when you lie down on a bed it's time for your body to relax just like when you've got your favorite food on the table you're about to have your dinner your taste buds are ready to enjoy what you're about to eat because you're eating something that you love eating it might be your favorite food whatever that may be you know that you're going to enjoy it and maybe you've been looking forward to it maybe just for the last hour while it's cooking possibly or maybe it's a takeout and you've been waiting for it to be delivered or perhaps you're in a restaurant you're looking forward to it or perhaps you're looking forward to your husband your wife your son, daughter, grandchild, parent, whoever, a best friend, you're looking forward to seeing them because you know how you feel when you are with them. When I used to visit my grandmother, I knew that when I visited her, I felt like 
like a small child that was safe and protected by my grandmother. Even though the last time I saw her, she was about 96 and I was 43 or something like that. I wasn't a small child, but I felt that safety from her when I was with her also when I thought about visiting her I knew that I was going to feel that way and the way I felt when I was with my grandmother was perhaps some of the best feelings I've ever had because of how much I cared about her. And to have that connection to a situation. When you think about it, lying down on your bed, that's something that we've done more times than pretty much anything else we've done in our lives. And it's something that we spent more time doing than probably anything else other than breathing. You very likely spent more time in your bed than you have watching television. So there's that natural connection between lying down on your bed, your head touches the pillow, your body naturally relaxes because that's what your body does. There's that connection, just as you have that connection with your favourite food or, as I said, meeting up with somebody that you care about deeply, just being in their presence or thinking about them. feeling when I think about Andre, just how cute he is, just lying there on the floor, Andre's my favourite by the way, he's my boy, but I have that connection, I have that emotional connection when I think about him, it feels nice, I look forward to seeing him when I wake up in the morning. I look forward to seeing him when I get home, when I've been out, just to check that he's okay, make sure he's fine, give him a cuddle, give him a big kiss. There's that connection that we have with our beds when you lay down on your bed. There needs to be a, a connection of safety involved and on a practical level if for whatever reason you don't like your bed invest in a new one or get a different one having a bed that you like that you feel comfortable in that you feel safe in is so important around in a pair of shoes that was two sizes too small, apart from that end up deforming your feet, if you did it for too long, you'd be in pain and it'd be uncomfortable, so when you're in that safe bed, your safe bed, your place of comfort, relax into that bubble of safety. It's almost like the bed is now just taking care of you. The bed is saying to you, you can close your eyes and just let go and I'll look after 
after you for the next seven hours or eight hours and you're going to be fine because I'm going to support you whilst you sleep soundly and deeply and I'll support your body whilst all your internal organs and your blood and everything's sending that healing energy to the different parts of your body whilst you sleep and your mind, your unconscious mind, can process those things that may need processing whilst you sleep. Which means you don't need to think about it when you're lying in your bed. Don't need to expect, don't need to wish for anything. lay down your head touches the pillow your body relaxes and your mind slows down even more because that's what you're used to doing because that's the natural automatically slows down slows down because this is your safe space to just be 
automatically, yet you can still enjoy the experience. In fact, you can enjoy it more because you know that there's no pressure on you to do anything, because it's 